Hey guys, this is Austin from Amanda's Gear. I had a pretty cool video we thought of today. Um, I actually recently just got one of these Yeti tumblers. Um, and I was I used it for the first time. Uh, I've used it a couple times since then. And you know, I thought, you know, this thing actually holds on to heat really stinking well. So I was actually kind of interested to see how long that actually does take. So, uh, for, for it to go back to room temperature. Um, so I'm actually gonna do a little bit of a, uh, a research thing. Um, and we're gonna see how long it takes uh, for uh, this this Yeti tumbler to get to room temperature from the time that I brew the coffee in it. All right, All right so I have this Yeti tumbler. Uh, this is on my Ninja uh, coffee bar. Um, so I have it set, I'm gonna have it set right here to my travel size. So what it's gonna, should do is fill it up most of the way. Um, and I'm gonna do it as a classic brew. Uh, normally I drink these things as a rich brew, but uh, for the sake of this one, uh, so that everybody knows, you know, most coffee makers are going to make it this kind of brew. Um, I have four four uh, Ninja scoops of, um, of Folgers coffee in here. Don't worry, I still get to have my coffee because, well, I have a, another Yeti, tum uh, Yeti mug right there. Um, and then right here, I'm going to be using this. Uh, what this is, is an instant read thermometer. So I'm going to stick it through the hole in the top of the of the cup here every hour until it gets back to room temperature. So let's go ahead and get this thing rolling. All right guys, so we now have this full. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this right off of there and I'm gonna go ahead and put this, uh, This I like this little this lid, it actually works really well. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep that closed until we do every research. Um, okay, so what time is it right now? Let's check my watch here. If I can get it there. All right, so it looks like we're about 8.35 right now. Um, so let's do a test. How hot is this right now? All right, so we got to turn this thing on. And it should be an instant read, so it looks like it's about 68 in here right now. So it looks like it's sitting about 177 degrees. All right, or 178. Okay, so let's, um, I'm going to go ahead and let it sit. Um, I was saying an hour earlier. Let's do it maybe every half hour. Um, and I'll be taking some pictures and videos throughout the, for, throughout the, the thing. All right, guys, here we are another half hour later. Um, it looks like we are sitting at about 9.38 a.m. now. Um, so we're going to go ahead and check this thing again. So this is a, a tiny bit over an hour after we've filled up the cup. So let's start this thing again. And then we're going to put it right in there. All right, looks like it is sitting at about 158 degrees, 159. Um, we actually haven't lost a ton of heat in an hour. That's pretty impressive. Um, so, all right, uh, that sounds good. I'm going to go ahead and set my alarm for another half hour, and we'll be taking a look. All right, guys, here we are. Uh, it's a bit longer than a half an hour, so more than I was kind of expecting. We're sitting at 10, 19 right now. So let's take a look and see where we are now. All right, let's open this up. Let's turn this on again. And let's see where we are temperature wise. That's pretty impressive. It looks like we only, I forget what the last one was, but like what, five degrees or so? Uh, so we're at 151 degrees. Well, cool. All right, let's come back in a half an hour and see where we are. Here we are again. This is the half an hour later. Uh, it looks like our time is about 10.50. Um, this has been quite a while now, and I'm actually pretty impressed with how well it's been holding its heat. So let's take a look again and see where we are temperature-wise. Make sure this turns on. All right. And put it down in there. All right, we are sitting at 145 degrees, and this is at... 1050, 1051 or so. 
Here we are, half an hour later. It looks like we are sitting at 11.21. I did not think that this was going to be an all-day project, but it seems like it is, which is pretty cool. Um, Yeti seems to be making a pretty good cup. So let's take a look and see where we are at now for temperature. Oop. Still in the 140s. All right, so we are at 140 degrees, which is still pretty respectable. All right, so we will look again. All right, guys, here we are a little bit later. It's 12.07, uh, a little bit past my plan time, but we are checking it out again. All right. I think the last time was 140 degrees it is now 134 so it's about what like 40 minutes later or so and only dropped about six degrees that's not too bad all right let's check it out in another half hour all right guys here we are at about 12 38 uh, p.m here and um, this is the yeti tumbler here let's take a look and see what we have for temperature. Now keep in mind we started this before nine o'clock so this is over two and a half hours later. Alright, looks like we're doing about 130 degrees. Alright, so it's still actually pretty warm in there. Um, Alright, I'm gonna come back and take a look at it here in a little bit again. All right, guys, here we are at 1.07 p.m. Um, and let's see where we are at. Hundred and twenty-six degrees. All right. Well, it's it's starting to get down there, but I mean, keep in mind we started this before nine o'clock this morning. So hopefully, if you haven't drinking your coffee by now, it's um, you're probably not going to. But um, I'll be uh, updated. Hey guys, so I I just realized that I had messed up. Um, so on in this last half hour, I left the uh, the cap here open. Um, with this still in there, so um, I'm thinking this is probably gonna be my last video or last uh, check-in on this. Um, but let's be honest, even based off the last one, I mean we're sitting at almost like, almost like a oh, three something hours, um, and it's still drinkable, still warm, and everything. So let's see where we are now. The, again, this is with this being open for the past half an hour. So let's see where we are. All right. Wow, even with leaving that open for a half an hour, it was still, still pretty dang hot in there. So now let's do a taste test, I guess. All right. All right, guys, so taste test. Um, I, I haven't actually tasted this one yet, so we'll see how this tastes and if it's still warm. And uh, if it is, that's pretty dang good for three hours of sitting here. And let's take a look. Yep, it is still drinkable coffee. This is something that I would still pick up and drink. So I would say that these Yeti tumblers are a pretty dang good deal. I think they're around 30 bucks. Um, I got this one as a gift, which is awesome. Um, however, I think I was buying them online for around 30 bucks, 25 bucks in that area. Um, and I do recommend them. I really like these things. Um, so anyways, uh, check them out. Uh, this is a Yeti tumbler. Uh, thanks guys, thanks for taking a look at this video, and I hope it kind of lets you know exactly what to expect when you're buying one of these. Anyways, have a good one.